must save her. My daughter. How's it going guys? Lucian Sword here playing some more Breath of the Wild for you today as always. Hope you're all having a fantastic day wherever you guys might be. So in the last episode we ended right here on this uh, structure I guess you could call it. I'm not really sure what this is uh, but we're in the middle of a deep canyon and there's it almost looks like there was a building here a long time ago, and there should be a shrine somewhere nearby. There's a Po right there that we'll take care of in a minute, but I'm trying to find where this shrine is. So let's just take a peek around and see what we find. Oh, okay. We got a Korok right here. Let's see. I'm gonna guess something like in here or... Hey, we got it. <laughs> I like his little branches of holly or whatever he's holding. That's so cute. Well, according to my shrine sensor, the shrine should be like right on top of us. So my guess is the shrine is either above or below us. And because it's not above us, unless it's in the cliffs, which I don't see any openings. I don't see any openings in the cliffs, so I'm going to guess, this is just a guess, that we are actually on top of it, which means we have to find a way to get down inside this structure somehow. So let's just keep going down. Look at the map real quick. The Forgotten Temple. Maybe this giant thing is the Forgotten Temple, which if that's the case, wow, that is insane. This thing is massive. Even as far as like temple temples go, this thing is huge. Uh, there's a lot of rubble. Like what are all these shapes? Maybe, I mean, I don't get it, but... I'm looking in case there's like more Korok seeds or anything while we head down this forgotten temple. We might be able to find some other stuff. Hey, there's a bomb over here. Maybe we can get in right here. Doesn't look like it, but we'll see. A rock. Hey, another Korok. Already two Koroks, guys, and we barely started this episode. Man, we're making good progress. Uh, let's see. We're almost to the end, so... This will give us our answer. If it was all for naught, then we'll just have to come back later and figure it out. If I can't get inside from over here. But it's alright, because we laid our travel medallion up there, remember? Oh my gosh! Yeah, it says rip. It says that I died there because I loaded into the game and I set the controller down to go make my tea. And I guess because I was up there, um, I died from cold. Like the cold slowly killed me and when I came back, I was dead. So it didn't really count as a death because I wasn't even playing. I didn't even think about the cold, so not counting that. So, all right, we, we came to a cliff. Let's just... See what's down here. Ooh, all right. It is the Forgotten Temple. This looks like an entrance of sorts. Let's see if we can get in right here. No. Oh, that would have been cool. Another Korok. Wow, there's a lot of Koroks around here. <laughs> oh, man. Setting the rock down on top of the Korok is just a tradition you have to honor, you know? Alright, what about even more down? 
All right, I guess. Ooh. Guys, I remember this now from Zumwar's playthrough. Oh yeah, this this is actually a really cool structure, how massive it is. <sighs> if I remember this right, there's guardians everywhere. They're all gonna be shooting at us. Okay, here we go. Okay, there's a lot more guardians than I thought. We might be able to dodge some of them. Oh my gosh, please. The key is to zigzag. Oh my goodness. Oh man. There's so many guys, there's so many. Oh my gosh, I'm so scared. Gotta use these pillars to block their line of sight. That's what you gotta do. Woo! Well, we found the shrine. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was a rush. Oof. Oh, there's a big goddess statue behind the shrine. I wonder if I could pray right there. That would be perfect because I can get my uh, heart container. All right, well, let's get this one first. We need one more shrine after this, guys. One more after this, and then I can get the Master Sword. I can't believe it, to be honest. Like, when I started Master Mode, I didn't even know if I was going to be able to get this far. Oh, it's a blessing. Sick. That's awesome. The Rona Kachta's blessing. Yeah. Wait a minute, do I have a weapon slot? Not really. Alright, let's see if it is a weapon. Oh my goodness, another great flame blade? These things are super rare, I'm telling you guys. I can't believe I'm going to have two of them at once. Uh, I guess I'm dropping the ice rod. Like, all of my weapons almost are elemental. <laughs> This is so crazy. Alright, I'll take it. And the spirit orb, of course. Wow. So we found multiple Koroks and we got the spirit orb. Man, the Forgotten Temple. I wonder if there's actually any like chests that you can get in the Forgotten Temple or other loot or secrets. It's kind of a dangerous place to explore when you're you know, don't have Rivali's Gale and all that other stuff. So, I don't think I want to hang out here too much, but I can take a peek. Actually, let me see if I can pray to the statue right here. At least we can get one heart container. I'd be really surprised if you couldn't. Dang, that's a big statue. You probably haven't had anybody pray at the statue in a long time, so... Let's do a uh, heart container, guys. And then we'll only have one more. Let's get some hearts in the chat. Hearts in the chat. For the 12th heart container. Or 12th heart piece, anyways. Ah, oh, yeah. Go and bring peace to Hyrule. Well, in order to bring peace, I have to do a lot of violence. I hope that's okay. All right, Cookie, this is uh, your time to shine, baby. You do well in situations like this. All right, so, um, oh wow, look at that. On the map, it shows all the enemies? Since when did that happen? What? And then these ones are shooting at me. That's crazy. 
Yeah, guys. I think it's, uh... Wait, I can't... I can't... Oh, there we go. Don't worry, Cookie. Uh, I'll warp you right as soon as I get there. So, like, time is standing still right now. You know what I mean? Time is standing still. I'm going to warp myself out, and then I'm going to warp Cookie out ASAP. So, Cookie will be fine. Oh, it's really cold. There we go. All right, I am freezing to death, literally. Uh, let's go ahead and summon in Wolf Link real quick. And then I really need to put on some warm clothes. There we go. Uh, this will this will keep my ears a little bit warmer. And I need some, some thicker legs. There we go. Although I do like the silent legs. That just kind of looks ridiculous. All right, boys. Um, so where where are we going? Oh yeah, we were gonna follow this road and then we got sidetracked. That's right. All right, this is the road. Let's just keep following it. See where we go. Ooh, ore. Never mind. Hold on. We got ore. I have like nothing good to to break the ore with. All right. We're gonna keep this sword on me because it keeps me warm too. Another shrine in the in the radar. That means we're gonna find our last shrine, guys. Maybe. Oh, that's a big old elk or something. Oh, there's a stables right here too. I don't see the shrine yet. But there's always a shrine near the stables. Oh yeah, snowfield stable. Hey, doggy! Hey, doggy, doggy! Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Last time I gave dog and gave dog some apples, I got 300 rupees out of it. No, Cookie, they're not for you. Um, actually, do I have chill? Yeah, stay cool. No, no, I wanna, I want sun shrooms. Stay, endure, endure the bitter cold. Yeah. Um, let's cook, cook some of these. I think I might need these guys to get to the Rito village. Then again, I do have a lot of, uh, flame weapons, so I guess I don't really. I'm guessing these are some peppers. Yep. To keep, keep warm. If you got flame weapons, it's actually not really needed. Ooh, the shield I will take. I don't have room for that. Alright, you know what, Cookie? If you're that hungry, here, here. You guys don't have to fight over apples, okay? You don't have to fight over the apples. You did really good down there, Cookie. I know it was pretty uh, scary, so good job. Actually, I, d I guess I don't need this helmet on, so let's do this one. Uh, in fact, okay, no, I do need that. All right. <laughs> I got a lot of shields now, I just realized that. Gotta take a sip of my tea while all my animals uh, eat up. Alright, he's bringing us to the treasure. Found it. Good boy. Give me another 300 rupees. Oh, Star Fragment. That is even better than 300 rupees. Thank you, kind doggy. Guys, our final shrine before getting the Master Sword, the Rin Oya Shrine. Hopefully it's not super tough, but either way, we're gonna do it and we're gonna get our 13th heart. Oh my gosh. Ooh. The only thing is, uh, I, I don't have a shrine to the Korok Forest yet, so we're going to actually have to go through the forest to get there, but, oh no. Oh no, is this the one with all the fans? It is. Oh, I remember this one. This one's kind of hard, I think. Oh gosh. 
Okay, I I uh, I remember this one. Wait, is that it? Oh. <laughs> They want you to do that first so that you can see what you have to do, but in reality, I need to be standing on that when this happens. That's the fun part. Okay, so there's a couple couple of these boys. Let's see. So let's start from the beginning and follow where the ball is going to actually go. So I'm going to be standing up there. Ball's going to roll down here. It's going to come this way. In fact, I do not want this to bother it. It will roll all the way across here. And then, in fact, I do not want this to bother it either. And that should be it. So, all right, maybe it wasn't that hard. <laughs> I, I have a feeling that it. I probably won't get this first try, but if I do, uh, yeah, then I guess it's destiny that I'm going to get the Master Sword. For Princess Zelda, give it to me first try! Ooh, it's going really fast. Easy. Easy! Wait, where's the chest? <gasps> I remember! I actually need those metal things over here okay this got way 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 more interesting I only need one cube actually okay here's how we do it here's the play it's basically the same thing except what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna throw it then as soon as it passes by here, I'm going to put this over there, and then I'm going to run up here. And then hopefully I can reach that. I like shrines that make you think. Alright, this... Sh yep. Alright, here we go. I could climb this, right? No! I can't climb it! Alright. So, what we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna do that. Right there. Um, I, do, I guess I just have to bring the, the metal uh, cube a little bit up the stairs. No problem. Not a big deal. Alright. Let's do that. Wait for it, wait for it, okay. Go, go, like, go. You, you go it up there with the cube, all right. We got it. There we go. Should have done that the first time, but I thought that I could actually climb on these, so my bad. Right, take about right there, should be fine. Woo! Nice! Ancient core, we need that for the armor or those awesome weapons. Guys, we did it. We can get the Master Sword now. Thank you guys for sticking with me this long into the series. I know not every episode is the most exciting. Some of them are. <laughs> Some of them were just exploring and having a good time. But I really, really appreciate the support you guys have been giving me on this series. And, uh, you know, I really, really appreciate it. I, this is more of a pet project of my own. I knew that when I started this, it wasn't going to get as many views as my Brawlhalla videos. But I'm not really doing it for the views per se. Like, I do want people to watch. But I just really wanted to share my love and passion for Zelda and for this game and other games besides Brawlhalla and... You know, like, even when I started making Brawlhalla videos, I didn't get any views for a long time. <laughs> it takes time, so 
I'm in this for the long haul, guys. I, I plan on play, playing Zelda games for a long time on my channel. Anyways. Oh, we have the, the spirit orb, so... Well, first of all, let's go in the stables. See if there's anything in here. Let's talk to Beetle. Hey. Wake up, Beetle, wake up. Uh, I guess we could buy his arrows. I have so many. This one will make us uh, endure the warm, or the cold. So will this. Wow, that's kind of expensive, Beetle. 45 rupees for only 10 arrows? Whatever. I, I always buy them all, and I like never use all my arrows, but whatever. Uh, let, let's just buy these, just because, whatever. They're cheap. They're cheap. Might as well buy them in case I really desperately need to, to have that. But I have a feeling... Oh, I guess I could have sold, but whatever. What's up, guys? Do you guys talk, or you just kind of sit here and... 1L? I've traveled to the east and the west in my great hunt for information, and now I find myself here in the freezing north. I heard there was a stall horse in this area, but I can't take it any longer. It's too cold to look anymore. <gasps> stall horse is a, a bone horse, I think. <laughs> yeah, okay. Wait, she wants me to take a picture of one? Okay. I think she said to the ruins, like, north of here. Eastern part of northern Tabantha Snowfield in the area surrounding some stranger. Eastern part of northern... Alright, well, I don't even have the map yet, so let, let's just worry about that first. I thought those were strawberries. They're like giant raspberries. Oh, a double axe over there. I do love double axes, but... Look at that purple dog! Is that just me, or is he kind of purple? Hey, he got it! He actually caught his own tail. What a pro. Roasted tree nut. Roasted wild berry, alright. Alright, let's go get the tower. We got plenty of time. Get the tower, then we'll warp back to uh, Kakariko Village. Talk to Impa, get the champion's tunic before we head out and get the Master Sword. Probably starting next episode, because we got a little bit of time here, but it's going to take me a little bit of time just to get to this tower. It looks close, but it's actually kind of far. Okay, eat some, drink some more tea while uh, Cookie takes us up. Yeah. <laughs> The horses in this game actually will follow the path without you even having to uh, steer if they're on a road. Like, I'm not steering at all. Oh, rush room. Anytime I see a rush room, I have to go for it because you need a lot of them to upgrade the uh, climbing gear. There we go. Another one. Gosh, I hate it how sometimes when you jump off, it jumps forward, and sometimes when you jump off, it just jumps straight up. Like, that's really inconsistent. Every single time I jump off, I'm holding forward, and yet only half of the time does it actually go forward. Wait, what is this? Dang, somebody's good at carving wood and destroying trees and turning them into elk. Or whatever those are, reindeer. Pondo's Lodge? Who's Pondo? Can I just come in? Hello? Where are you, Pondo? I heard I heard somebody walking around. Oh. oh. Hail, kiddums. Nice to meet a fresh face in these parts. It's not every day I get company in th these hive hills. Oh, snowball bowling. Heck yeah, let's do it. 20 rupees? Easy. I'll be back in a flurry. 
Get it? Like a flurry of snow? Okay. Oh. I get two rolls. Knock them flat. Oh. All right, boys, here we go. I'm gonna say about right here. Come on, baby, come on, baby. Ooh, not bad, not bad. We can still get a spare. Not bad. Oh. Wow, the loading is a long oh. time. Yep, especially when you keep talking in between my throws. <laughs> All right, here we go, guys. A little bit more to the right this time, eh? eh? Wait. Okay, you can't walk that close. Got you. And another loading screen. Okay. Yep, don't please. Oh. Okay, okay. Oh. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. <laughs> All right, this time I'm just going to drop it right in the middle. Okay, the middle is the, the is is not oh. the way to go. Okay, let's try again. Okay, I got you. All right, I know there's a tower right there, guys. Don't worry about it. Aww. We will. Yeah, that's got a sting. Wow. <laughs> Take my money, old man, and give me the snowballs. Get out of my way. I'm gonna get a strike right here. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Good luck. Pfft. Watch this. No. 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 Oh, 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 my, what? You're oh. kidding me. It was trying to push it over. That was definitely the spot, man. That was definitely the spot. I got completely jipped. Oh. All right, now I got a really yeah. hard shot of trying to hit just one. Okay, that ain't it. I just wanted to see what would happen if I dropped it over there. Now I know. I got nine. Oh. Snow close, and yet snow far. <laughs> oh my gosh. Hey, I got my money. Well, some of my money back. Yeah, let's do it again, guys. Come on. I gotta get the strike. Alright, this time, I'm really feeling it. Oh. Pondo, your kind of guy I would chill. Hey, your kind of guy I would chill with. All right, here we go. <laughs> Get it, really? Get it? Chill with? <laughs> Cause it's cold. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here's the throw. It's got curve back. Oh yeah. Oh, a little bit too much to the left. Ah. Oh. All right, we only got three left. I get that. Oh. Man, the loading time is ridiculous. Oh. All right. Whoops. Curve right, curve right. Yes. Oh, that was so close. <laughs> I cannot accept defeat of these stupid pins. I will. Oh. That's decent. I'll give you a sampler prize. Alright, I got my money back. Alright. Yes. <laughs> He's just mocking me. He's like, I get strikes every day. Alright, here, here's the play, guys. We're gonna aim it a little bit like this this time. Gonna curve back right, curve back right. Gosh! Okay. All right. Ooh. All right, yep. All right, I think what it is is I'm going, I'm starting too much on the right. I got, I got hit that sweet spot of like, oh. just to the right of this mound right here. All right, let's do it like right here. Huh? Oops. Right here. 
Come on, come on! Ah, oh, so close, so close. Oh. Dang, this is a lot harder than it looks. I remember when Zomor was doing this, it took him oh. like... Well, let's just say it took him a lot of tries. I don't remember how many. Uh -huh. But, I'm pretty sure he eventually did get it, and so will I. <laughs> I gotta get it, man. I gotta get a strike. I don't oh. even want a spare. I want a strike. <laughs> All right, let's try something different. How about right here? Right, right here, right here. Here it is. Ooh, that's actually a good one. Oh! That's the spot. Yes! Yes! I got it! The whole time it was the spot on the left, guys. Ah. Well, bowl me over, kiddums. A snowing like that deserves an ice prize. How about this snowball making doohickey? What? Oh! I'll take the money. <laughs> Alright, what's he give me if I nail it again? Another strike. Does he keep giving me 300 rupees? Because if he does. Oh. This is gonna be easy peasy. Watch this, old man. Watch and learn. Okay, okay, okay. That one was a, a warm up shot. Oh. I love this music. Ooh, we are at time. All right, I got one more shot before the video's over. One more shot. I'm gonna say about right here. Okay, that, that, okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, that, that was terrible. That was, that, <laughs> he can't even see the ball. Aww. No, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. I'm done, that's it. No more. Aww. You, you got, you got a gambling. You got like an addiction thing right here, man. I, I could do this all day. I uh, hope you don't mind, Pondo, but I need to take a break in your house. Thank you, sir. Ah, warmth. Alright, guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, we are really, really close to go get in the Master Sword now. And, um, yeah, I think we're gonna rest here. We're gonna go get the, uh, the tower after this. And, uh, maybe... You know, we'll see what else is nearby, but I just want to get the tower, then we'll get the Master Sword, and then I, I do want to get these other towers and stuff in this area, but we can get that after we get the Master Sword, I guess. So yeah, please drop a like if you enjoyed, and uh, be sure to subscribe for more Zelda and other games, and I hope to see you in the next video, guys. Take it easy. This is Lucian Sword. Let's just, uh, let's just get warm by the fire right here. That's a good spot.